Alright, so in this video we're going to be looking at how to uh, extract sounds out of Minecraft in later versions. Um, so since somewhere around 1.7.5, maybe a few versions before or after, they uh, changed how, my, uh, how sound is stored and it would seem that sound doesn't even exist in any of the uh, in any of the Minecraft folders. So we'll go to percent app data percent and it used to be if we go to Minecraft assets there used to be a folder in here called sounds it had all the OGGs it was simple and intuitive they were clearly labeled but they decided to change it and make it much more complicated um, I, they, I don't know if it saves on space I'm sure they have their reasons uh, but it is what it is so if we go to indexes we have we'll have one or more files here and they'll be labeled with the uh, with the version uh, it goes with so I'm gonna be using 1.8 since that's the latest version um, at the time I made this video so I'll go ahead and open that well by default you'll probably have to right click and open with um, and you can use wordpad or notepad wordpad will give you this um, you can use this it has all the information you need but it's much more confusing uh, whereas notepad or wordpad uh, chops it up nicely um, so you'll see we have what seems to be like a file path or something then you have hash this stuff and then size we're gonna be looking at this last part here which is the sound and then this is how we'll find it so we can scroll down here we can see all the sounds we can browse but if you want to find a specific sound I'll just hit control F and we can type in a specific sound I'm gonna go with um, some let's say I want to add some music to uh, a video I'm making I'll go with uh, calm one all right and I'll take us there we see we have calm one dot OGG and then we have this hash and this is how we'll find it so we go back in here and go to objects this is actually where all the sound is stored and that may seem odd since if you open any of these you just get these random files uh, with no extension um, but if we search the, uh, some of these letters here so we have 50 a 5 50 a 5 and we'll find this and this is actually calm one now by default we won't be able to open this with uh, a Windows Media Player or QuickTime or any of those common media players will need something that can open uh, files without extensions and a common a pretty popular one is VLC Media Player uh, if you don't already have VLC Media Player it's an awesome free uh, media player that plays so many different file formats it's way better than uh, QuickTime or Media Player uh, Windows Media Player that is um, and it's awesome and you can do a lot of stuff with this and it's pretty necessary for what we're about to do so I'll open with VLC Media Player, and if I jump ahead somewhere where there's more action, we can hear uh, it's playing the music. Now, if we want to use this in a video in like Premiere or Vegas or whatever video editing software, we won't be able to use this uh, uh, extensionless file. We'll need it something. We'll need something more usable. So, uh, if we're using Media Player or VLC Media Player, that is, you can convert. Uh, sound or videos right out of it so convert slash save I'll drag this in here convert save it'll ask me how I want to save it I'm gonna go with audio dash CD this is a wave uh, wave format I'll save it as calm one and I'm just saving this in my music folder I'll hit save and start it'll do it pretty much instantly um, and now if I go to music we'll see how we have calm one dot WAV and if I double click it it'll open with media player just fine and if media player can open it then pretty much anything else <laughs> anything else can probably open it and I'll go ahead and jump and we can hear it's fine alright so that's how you extract sounds um, now doing these one by one well you can actually do multiple file uh, well, you can do multiple files with VLC but pretty much doing these individually is a very tedious process so if you're making like a, um, a resource pack for example I would just um, I would just google default resource pack for minecraft or whatever and just use that but if you want like for in this example I used uh, music for a video if you just want a specific sound and you just want its original you know you want the raw the actual music without any changes if you were to go online and search for it anyway uh, you can do this and get uh, individual sounds so yeah, that's it. If this was helpful for you guys, a like would be great, and thanks for watching.